Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, I'm going to find the first and second derivative of f of x is equal to the square root of x times e to the x. First thing we're going to do is we're going to turn the square root of x into x to the 1 half. This is just going to make it easier to find the derivative. But our first step in finding the first derivative, we're going to take this and we're going to say, okay, we can use the product rule since this is x to the 1 half times e to the x. The product rule says, okay, we're going to have x to the 1 half times the derivative of e to the x plus e to the x times the derivative of x to the 1 half. Simplifying this, we get x to the 1 half times the derivative of e to the x is e to the x plus e to the x times the derivative of x to the 1 half. Doing this, we can say, okay, we have a power function, so you bring down the exponent and then subtract 1 for your new exponent, which is going to get us 1 half minus 1, which is negative 1 half. And this is going to be x to the 1 half e to the x plus 1 half x to the negative 1 half e to the x. All right, this is your first derivative. Taking the derivative of this will give us the second derivative. So. We basically have the same thing but double now. We're going to take this using the product rule and this using the product rule. So for this first term, we have actually the, we can just take, actually just think of this as taking the derivative of x to the 1 half e to the x. Don't actually worry about the product rule for this one. We'll see why. We will be taking the product rule for the second term. So it'll be x to the negative 1 half times the derivative of e to the x plus the derivative plus e the x times the derivative of x to the negative one half. So the derivative of x to the one half e to the x. Where have we done that before? Well that's actually just the derivative over again. So this we've already calculated out to be this. So we have x to the one half e to the x plus one half x to the negative one half e to the x. Right, we're basically just doing, we, we would have been doing this over again. So we can just plug this in, that's our first term, and now we can solve the second term and add everything together. So, plus one half x to the negative one half times the derivative of e to the x, the derivative of e to the x is e to the x, plus one half e to the x times the derivative of x to the negative one half. Again, power function, bring down the exponent, and then your new exponent is the old one minus one, negative one half minus one is negative three halves. So, continuing on, we get x to the one half e to the x, and then these are actually like terms, all right? We've got one half x to the negative one half e to the x, plus another one half x to the negative one half e to the x, so 1 half plus 1 half is 1, so plus x to the negative 1 half e to the x, and like plus 1, but you don't have to write the plus 1. And then plus 1 half times negative 1 half is minus 1 fourth, x to the negative 3 halves e to the x. And this is your second derivative. Now we have found both. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.